Hello and welcome to your East End spoilers for the week beginning the 24th of January. Harvey puts pressure on Dana to keep what Aaron did a secret. Scared it will all come out, she phones in sick for work as they plan to flee Walford, but Peter and Mila overhear Dana speaking on the phone call she thinks she had hung up from. The secrets get exposed, but what exactly is the secret? Will everyone know Aaron was behind the bomb, or is there another secret baking in the oven? Gray's hold on Chelsea gets tighter this week when he persuades her to throw away her anti-depression medication and when Whitney sees this she asks Kira to step up and help. He arranges a flat for Chelsea to escape to and at the hospital almost gets a confession from Gray that is until they are interrupted by some worrying news that means Chelsea has to come back to him. Stuart panics this week when the doctor tells him he will need an operation and the idea of taking painkillers worries him so much that he runs away. Rainy eventually tracks him down using her phone and he finds him at a church where he is found by a grave. The grave is of an old friend of Stuart's who died from a pill addiction and Stuart is worried that he will have the same fate. Will Rainy be able to talk her husband around and bring him home to have the operation safely? Ben is still struggling with the attack that is playing on his mind and Callum does his best to communicate to his husband, but will Ben listen to a word that Callum has to say? Phil is still lying to Kat about his prison sentence and when she pushes him to open up, he ends the relationship with her. Later in the week, Sharon speaks to Phil and gets the truth out of him, giving him the choice of telling Kat himself or she will do it for him. And finally, Mick steps in to make Janine seem like a good mum when he gives Scarlett a present that he says is from Janine. But really, it's from him. And there you go, those were your spoilers for the week winning the 24th of January. Remember, if you've enjoyed this, we also have a podcast every Sunday where we review the whole week in full. So make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any content, and give a comment below and let me know. What are you most looking forward to seeing this week?